Hello, this is Lucas from uh, Trusted Doctor, and I'm here today with Dr. Tina um, Walters at 108 Medical Chambers. Good afternoon to you. Hi. Uh, so the first question would be, what is your uh, niche area of specialist uh, focus? I'm a consultant breast surgeon. I've been working as a consultant breast surgeon here at uh, the London Breast Clinic, which is 108 Harley Street for the past 22 years. So I've got quite a lot of experience. and. Um, Essentially what I do is to diagnose breast problems. So anybody who goes to see their GP with a breast problem, the GP or whoever will then refer them on to me with a breast problem. So any breast problem, including problems with breast pain, benign breast problems, um, breastfeeding problems, breast infections and particularly breast lumps. And then diagnosing whether or not a breast lump is benign or malignant and then if it does turn out that it is a breast cancer to go on and offer the patient the appropriate treatment and bringing in other specialties for the management of that breast cancer. I always describe myself as a bit like the ringmaster in a circus. So I'm in charge and I bring in the other acts. So I'll always be in charge with the patient. I'll always look after the patient, but when they need to see a radiologist, we refer them to the appropriate radiologist and then the pathologist will diagnose any problem and then possibly oncologists, radioth radiotherapists. Um, and we can also sometimes use need fertility specialists, geneticists, breast care nurses, so I, I kind of control the whole management of the whole m process of looking after somebody who's diagnosed breast cancer. Thank you very much. We were just discussing it. You, you rightly pointed out that it's obvious that the patients uh, need to reach the right doctor for the specific condition. But my question would be, what are the mechanics? You know, how do they get to the right doctor? Well, traditionally in this country in the past, um, we used to have GPs and the GPs would, would have a relationship with the, with the local doctors in the local hospital. In fact, in the ancient days, the old way that it worked was that the consultants in the hospitals trained the junior doctors and then those junior doctors went out to become the GPs and then they would sort of send their patients back to their, to their mentor. Right. Um, but of course things change and now um, we don't really have those sorts of mechanisms of personal relationships anymore. In fact, um, most of our uh, most of our referrals now are quite generic, right. and so we get them from all sorts of different specialties, so all, from, all all sorts of different areas, and hopefully in the future from 